This is the unboxing of the Mirage camera, the VR 180 degrees 3D camera from Lenovo that works with Google Photos and YouTube. Coming up. Hi and welcome to MRTV. My name is Sebastian Ang and if this is your first time here and if you're just as excited about VR and AR as I am, then subscribe now and click on the bell button so you don't miss anything. So this is the Lenovo Mirage camera. It just launched for $299 next to the Lenovo Mirage Solo VR standalone headset. And what does this camera do? Well, it can take pictures and videos in 180 degrees in 3D. Yes, in 3D, thanks to these two cameras. So as you can tell here, it works with Google Photos and YouTube. So once you upload these pictures to YouTube or to your Google Photos account, then you can watch them in virtual reality in 180 degrees in 3D through your VR headset, through the Lenovo Mirage Solo or also through other VR headsets. And well, now, we're going to have a look what's in the box. So here it is, the unboxing of the Mirage camera. So let's pick it up and have a look at the sides of this box. So here, the front, the camera, of course, with that two cameras on it. Then, yeah, Google Photo and YouTube. And that's it. Let's directly open it and see what's inside. So we're directly greeted here by the Mirage camera and those two fisheye lenses. Looks good so far. And let's take it out and have a look. And what we see here is that there is no screen. Again, there is no screen on that camera, which for $299 is not so nice. All right, peel it out of this plastic and let's have a look. Yeah, so we see, we see nothing here. <laughs> so no display here. On top, we have the shutter button and here are, well, the two fisheye cameras. Let's have a closer look now at what else we can find here. Okay, here on this side there's nothing. On the back, on the left, there are some LEDs that show in which mode the camera is working. Is it photo, is it video, or is it live? And here we open this and we can find the USB-C and the micro SD card slot. So we can add some more memory to it if we need to. Yeah, and honestly, that is really everything here on this side. Let's close this again. Yeah, we can mount the camera, which is of course very good. This is a standard mount. So we can put it on any kind of tripod we come across. Then here we have the shutter button and we have an on and off button right next to the shutter button, the small round one. And on the left, there's a function function button so we can change between the camera modes as in do we want to take a picture or do we want to take a video and that is really everything that's that is there to the to the uh, mirage camera so it's very very simple straightforward and what 299 dollars oh it is really expensive so we have to find out how good are actually the the pictures and videos that you take with this camera. All right, let's have a look here into this little box. Let's see what we can find inside. Probably it's going to be the power brick. <laughs> uh, <laughs> my educated guess and indeed, it's the power brick, it's the, the cable to connect it. And also we have uh, see okay this is the cable and yeah wow this is cool so we have we have another battery here actually so this is the spare battery so there's already a battery in in the camera as you will see later 
so it comes with two batteries this is cool so you can always bring the spare battery and yeah that is pretty nice so here it is here you can see the spare battery so um two batteries here with the mirage solo and that is really pretty nice and you can simply exchange the battery just like that okay that's pretty much everything that we got here for the mirage camera very simple and straightforward so there's still a bit more in the box let's have a look what's still hiding there and Ta -ta. some manuals <laughs> but that's not what I wanted to show you there is still something more um, okay this is the quick start guide and the manual here there's a little pouch for your camera which actually is really nice and we yeah, are for the price it is totally fine to put in a nice bag so with this you can store your Mirage camera and bring it any way you want to bring it so that's definitely something that I'm going to use and um, yeah I'm going to bring it on my next vacation which is going to happen very soon so I'm going to make some nice 3d videos and pictures from Barcelona where I am going to go all right that is really everything for this unboxing of the Mirage camera so this was the unboxing of the Mirage camera, a VR 180 degrees 3D camera. And yeah, so after my unboxing, my very first impressions, it looks nice. It looks very well built and it feels so, but I'm still wondering, $299? How do they get to that price point? And at that price point, why doesn't it even have a display why doesn't it, have, doesn't it have an LCD display so that you can see what you're actually taking a video or picture of so you have to you have to connect this with your um, smartphone in order to get it that screen and um, yeah I think that is a bit strange for this price point because let's be honest it has two fisheye cameras okay that's nice it has a standard battery probably inside of course it has a Bluetooth module but the magic anyways happens in software so wow $299 it is kind of overpriced that's my first reaction because I believe that the hardware probably cost $50 probably so yeah I really think that the price is very very high Anyways, I'm going to give this an in-depth review. I'm going to use that for the next couple of days and see what it can do. One thing that I'm personally excited about, it can directly live stream to YouTube. So I could do a live show in 3D and probably I'm going to give it a try. So probably for that, it might be incredible and awesome. Well, you will find out here on MRTV once I'm going to bring you the full review of the Mirage camera. All right, that's it for this unboxing and very first impression video of the Mirage camera. If you have any more questions, please do leave them in the comment section below or much better, why don't you directly chat with me or the MRTV community on the MRTV Discord server. The MRTV Discord server is a great free resource that lets you chat yeah, with me and the MRTV community and completely free of charge. You can get to the MRTV Discord server simply by clicking on the link in the description below. And that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it was helpful for you. If yes, give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you have not yet subscribed to MRTV, do so now. I'm looking forward to see you in the next episode.